Hello all and welcome back to Vlogmas Day 2. It is December 3rd <laughs> and today's video is just going to be pretty chatty. Um, it's the sweater weather tag. I thought it was appropriate for this time of year and I'm really sorry because it's like 4.30 and it's getting kind of dark in here so I'm hoping you can see me, um, you know, since it's starting to get dark at like 4 o'clock now. So. We'll see what we can do with what we've got. And I've got my big chunky sweater on and my warm cup of coffee and my candle and um, yeah, let's get into it. The first question is what is your favorite fall scent? I don't know if they mean like candle scent or outdoor scent. <laughs> I love the smell of holiday drinks, like holiday coffees at Starbucks and stuff. I don't know how else to describe that. <laughs> Seasonal baked goods <laughs> like pumpkin and cinnamon, oh, like cinnamon spice. It's just, it makes me feel so cozy and warm. <laughs> I love it so much. Next question is appropriately tea, coffee, or hot chocolate? For me, it will always be coffee. I am. A coffee person through and through. I enjoy tea sometimes, pretty much only peppermint tea, but I can go for like a nice cup of like iced green tea every once in a while. But um, yeah, coffee all the way hot coffee, iced coffee, specialty coffees, any kind of coffee. I drink it pretty much any time of the day. Um, I blame college for that, but it is what it is. <laughs> Get it? That's what my cup says. What is the best fall memory you have? This is really tough. I've gone to Disney in the fall before for like the Halloween party with my cousins. That was probably one of the best days of my life. That was so much fun. The decorations and we got all dressed up and we got to dance with Chip and Dale dressed up as like astronauts or something like that. I got to skip school. My mom let me skip school and we just flew to Florida and met my cousins down there and had the best time. We were swimming in October, which you don't do in New Jersey. It was so spontaneous and so much fun. So that would probably be one of my favorite fall memories. Which makeup trend do you prefer? Dark lips or winged eyeliner? I think I prefer winged eyeliner just because I'm really fair, so I don't wear bold lips that that often. I really enjoy a dark lip every once in a while, especially with your outfit. I guess it depends on the outfit, but I wear winged eyeliner pretty much every day because I have really small eyes and I feel like it helps make them look a little bit bigger um, and accentuates the shape of them, but sometimes you just need both. Why not both, right? Life's too short to not have winged eyeliner and bold lips if you ask me. <laughs> hear them laughing. <laughs> Maggie likes a boy. Here we go. Best fragrance of fall. I love Bath and Body Works candles. So there's quite a few scented candles that just bring me straight back to fall. I love leaves. I actually have that in my car right now, like in one of the little, um, not air fresheners, I guess air fresheners, um, that like blows through your vents. Oh my gosh, it smells amazing. Every time I get in the car, I'm like, oh my gosh, it's fall. So I actually have this one from Bath and Body Works burning right now. It's from like the White Barn branch of Bath and Body Works. And it's peppered suede. I don't even know how to describe it. It's just crisp and clean, kind of musky. I love it. I love it. I love it. I'm trying to think of other fall scents. Like pumpkin cinnamon, that's a pretty good one. Um, flannel, oh, that one's musky. That one smells like a man. <laughs> Favorite Thanksgiving food? I think it's a tie between macaroni and cheese and mashed potatoes. I think like traditional Thanksgiving food would have to be mashed potatoes. My uncle makes the best mashed potatoes in the entire world. I haven't had them in a few years, but sometimes I just start thinking about them and I can honestly cry. 
because they're that good. But yeah, if not traditional macaroni and cheese, my stepdad Tom makes the best homemade mac and cheese, baked mac and cheese, so you've got like the breadcrumbs on top. Oh, it's so good. What is autumn weather like where you live? Um, so I am originally from New Jersey and right now I'm going to school in Maryland. So it's pretty similar at both places. It's a little bit warmer here than it is in New Jersey, just by a few degrees. It doesn't snow as much, um, but it's gotten, it's so warm still here. Like strangely, it's December 3rd and it was like 47 degrees today or something like that. And for here, like that's really, really warm. It's chilly, it's crisp. Um, but for the fall, it's usually, it's usually around the 60s, which is perfect. I'm hoping once I move to Florida, that's like the coldest it gets in the winter and you can have like, you know, a nice jacket on top of a sweater and you're warm, but you don't need like a parka and like hats, gloves, and a scarf. So that's my goal in life. Maryland weather is super duper bipolar. One day it was 65 degrees in November and the next day it was 32 and windy. The wind is really bad, but it just fluctuates back and forth all the time. You never, you have to check the weather every single day, you know, when you wake up to know what you're going to wear because it could be 70 degrees or it could be 32 degrees back to back. It's the strangest thing. My most worn sweater. I don't know if I have one. Actually, that's a lie. I do have one. Please hold. Oh! I snapped him. Did he reply? Right away, sister friend. Right away. Right, sorry about that. I would say this is definitely my most worn sweater. It's starting to get a little bit scuzzy. <laughs> I don't know. But it's got these trumpet sleeves and it's just a nice gray. It's from Zara. Um, I got it last year and I wore it all of the time. And I've already worn it like five times this year. Love it. It's so soft and it's so warm. I wasn't expecting it to be as warm as it is because it's kind of thin, but it's just perfect. It's perfect for every day with a nice necklace or a scarf if it's really cold. Yeah, definitely my favorite sweater. Alright, football game. Oh! I'm so sorry. I had to tell you what you just said. Okay. Did you spill? No. Okay. No. Because I would have mopped it up. I'm sorry I keep interrupting. It's fine. I almost just literally <laughs> threw my coffee. Okay, so the next question is what is your most worn nail polish this fall? And mine is this one. It's from Essie. It is Angora Cardi is the name of it. Um, number 700. And it's just like a deep burgundy. Um, I'm not wearing any right now because I've been acting in a short film for a friend um, for the past couple weeks and I couldn't have anything on my nails because I was afraid for like the continuity in the film that if something chipped I would have to like it was just a whole big thing so I'm like I'm not gonna put anything on my nails but I'm so excited to paint my nails now I'm done so, <laughs> so I can actually have some nail polish on and feel like a human being I'm really excited and it will be that one football games or jumping in leaf piles probably football games um, we don't really have leaf piles around here and I feel like that's kind of <laughs> dirty <laughs> um, and Maggie's super into football so we watch a lot of football in this apartment I am a Giants fan I enjoy football they're really not doing well this year so it actually makes me mad but usually I enjoy it I like going to football games actually I like watching football games I shouldn't say I like going I like going if it's warm but I don't like being freezing so Football's my favorite sport to watch though. Skinny jeans or leggings? I mean, I really think it depends on the day and the outfit and the shirt or the sweater that you're wearing, but usually skinny jeans. Like eight times out of 10 skinny jeans, even if they're like ripped or something. I feel like they go with sneakers or booties or boots or whatever kind of shoes you want to wear. More than leggings, leggings are kind of like my man. I'm freezing <laughs> day or I just really don't feel like doing anything or I'm doing homework kind of thing um, but I definitely prefer skinny jeans yeah I have about 10 pairs of skinny jeans in like every color 
so hard preference for skinny jeans. <laughs> combat boots or Uggs? Definitely combat boots. I don't even have much to say about that. I have brown and black combat boots, and I only wear my Uggs to like the grocery store at midnight. <laughs> I don't even wear them out anymore, really. Is pumpkin spice worth the hype? I believe it is. Barely. But yes, I enjoy myself a nice pumpkin spice latte. I just tried my first one this year and it was really good, so I can't complain too much. Um, I'm trying to think, like, pumpkin spice everything's a little bit much. Okay, hold the phone. Pumpkin spice special K is the greatest cereal to ever exist. And it's limited edition. And now it's gone. I'm so sad. I found, okay, me and Maggie went to the store one night at like 11.30 and I was like, I can't believe they discontinued the pumpkin spice. I was so sad. And I found the last box in the store on the shelf and I literally started crying. <laughs> I guess it was just one of those days. <laughs> But I was literally crying over the box of Special K that I found in the store. I can't really get into like everything pumpkin spice, but pumpkin spice latte, pumpkin spice Special K, that's okay with me. <laughs> Favorite fall TV show? Um, right now we're watching Riverdale, and that's pretty much the only TV show that we watch. Um, my mom really loves This Is Us, and she's trying to get me to watch it, but I have to like catch up on the whole first season. But right now we just watch Riverdale, and I think that's our favorite TV show. Um, Shameless is on. I watch Shameless, but only on Netflix. Like, I don't watch it when it's on TV. But Riverdale would probably be our favorite. Yeah, and that's on the CW. It's on Wednesdays at 8 o'clock. So, if you're interested in catching up on the latest Riverdale drama, tune in. And then the last question is what song really gets you into the fall spirit? I love Spotify for like the playlists and uh, there was like a fall playlist on there that I listened to all the time, especially at work. It was so just like soothing and calming and it was great. But I think my favorite fall song is Autumn Leaves by Ed Sheeran. That one just like oozes fall, autumn spirit. I just like it, it feels like a walk through the woods when the trees are changing colors. I don't know what it is about it. It's simple, but it's wonderful. It really is. Gotta love Ed. It's the best. But that's it for the sweater weather tag. If you enjoyed this video, like, subscribe to see other Vlogmas videos coming at you this month. And uh, thanks for watching. I'll talk to you soon. <laughs> So yeah, that's the sweater weather tag. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to see more Vlogmas videos coming at you this month. And let me know what you guys do in the fall that you think is really fun or unique or you enjoy doing or that means a lot to you. I would love to hear about all the fun things to do and maybe things that I never thought of before. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>